Hello guys and welcome back to the channel or welcome to the channel if you're your very first time here. I know I haven't said anything about watching this but the trailer dropped and I thought you know what I'm gonna do a reaction whilst I watch it. It makes sense because I haven't done that for the last one. So we are watching the titles revealed trailer of Doctor Who. By titles revealed I presume it's going to be the titles of the episodes and not the title sequence reveal you know of the vortex and all of that kind of stuff. Uh, so let's see. Oh, I did this Cyber dog. To say goodbye. Oh no. We'll say goodbye to who? Special one. The Starbies. Try and see all the details. Wild Blue Yonder. Driving you mad. Laughing at the human race. The giggle? I've not seen any mention. Speak the meat. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, there's so much in that. Incredible that we've got another trailer today. So the Donna thing, is that a goodbye to him? Or is that a goodbye to her? Because she knows about the Doctor now. So does that mean it's a goodbye to her? Because if she knows about him, her brain will just... If that makes any sense. Also, the spaceship falling. Is that beep the meep spaceship, potentially? Also, I'm loving the uh, the quick hint at Rose there. You just see in that shot of Rose. We saw her in the previous trailer, um, but we saw a brief snippet of her here. Not talking or anything, but just a quick snippet next to the Doctor. And also it's quite nice that she's travelling with the Doctor, or she's with the Doctor at that point as well. So it's Rose and the Doctor again, which is quite funny. The aliens with the with the, the big boggly eyes and that. I know that they're a Doctor Who villain, but I don't know their names. Uh, and I know the Star Beast is named, but presumably they're not Star Beasts. Is Beep the Meep the Star Beast? I know there's a lot of Whovians that know this kind of stuff already. I don't because I've seen all of New Who, but I've not seen much of Classic Who. I've only up, seen up until the Marco Polo storylines. So I'm, I'm yet to see who the Star Beast is, what the Star Beast is. So that's going to be special one. The redacted thing, do we, has, has anybody broken that down as to what it is? I'm not going to look it up, but it's interesting. The 15, 7, 15, 20, 20, are, is, are they dates? I just I just wonder what the unknown error code was in the corner, because there's got to be some reason for it. What's the, the, the shot of the Doctor just before the wild blue yonder? <gasps> I just realised! Yes! In the title screens, uh, behind it, it's the Vortex, uh, David Tennant's Vortex from the 10th Doctors. That's amazing. I mean, I'm happy if just the, if the Vortex is only only just for this. Or are we going to see the Vortex in the new episodes behind the title sequence of the new episodes? How are they going to do that? Are they, are they just going to have his title sequence uh, with the old Vortex but the new logo and then Shooty Gatwa is going to come into it with a complete new thing with the new logo as well? Or maybe Shooty Gatwa keeps it as well. Second title being uh, Wild Blue Yonder. I really like that title. It's very apt for the Doctor's TARDIS adventures. I was looking at the, you know, the shot of the motorbike guy. Who is that? Because it's there for a reason, obviously. Is that just to show some of the mania that's going on around them all? You've got the David Tennant's Doctor in front of the screens with that weird face that he brings up on the screen, which looks a bit like, do you remember the... Uh, got a leg here, got a leg here. I think I say say it anyway. Got a leg here, got a leg here. Uh, from the Matt Smith storyline, you know, the, the, the puppets in the hotel. That was a, by far one of my favourite episodes of his run anyway. Um, I just really like that almost Shining-esque hotel. Uh, and Creeped Out, the TV show, did a very similar episode to that as well. Third one is The Giggle. I can't believe I didn't notice the uh, the other title sequence, uh, Vortex, um, before, because I was looking at the titles before, not the backing. The Beep the Meep shot is brilliant. I love Beep the Meep. And again, I, I don't know Beep the Meep. I know of him and what people have shown uh, like on pictures and stuff and from the previous trailer and I looked up who he was and it was Beep the Meep. I don't know anything about him. I don't know if he's a good guy. He looks so cute and fluffy. So fluffy! But I don't know who he is. I'd, I'd rather find out in the episode because presumably they're going to reintroduce him um, for the new audiences. Then you've got Donna as well saying, what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> it's brilliant. Also, what's Cyberdog? Is that the name of a Cyberman nightclub? 
maybe? Maybe they're hypnotizing the uh, patrons that go in there. Yeah, okay, that looks amazing. Uh, there's nothing else I can see. I've gone through it a few times and there is nothing that I can see that's... I, I might miss something, but I can't see anything else that's sort of hidden in there or other meanings other than potentially some of that code in the glitch. That, that, presuming there is something in that glitch. But yeah, check it out for yourselves. Let me know what you think. And are you excited for the uh, the new series with Tennant for the specials and then Shooty Catwell for the, uh, for the next Doctor? I cannot wait for the future of Doctor Who. It's going to be amazing. And I'm really excited to, to watch all of my classic Who's that I'm watching at the moment. Uh, I've been really enjoying watching those and also re-watching them when I'm editing as well. And uh, seeing your guys' reactions to it as well. So uh, yeah. Take care, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, if you like this kind of thing, then please feel free to subscribe uh, because it really helps me and the channel out. And also it helps me to continue making some more videos and also to help the videos get seen as well. Take care. Thank you so much. And I'll speak to you next time. Stay safe. Bye bye. Do not forget to click below to subscribe to the YouTube channel. I'd just like to say a massive thank you to all of my wonderful supporters over on Patreon. And that includes... Roger C. Griffith, Douglas Collier, Terry V, Michael, Chris Holmes, Seth, Thomas Masters, Shoehorn1234, Ress, Patrick Durr, Andrew Blount, Carlos, and Marla Mize. Plus, any of you that is new to the Patreon as well. <laughs>